Today I'm going to use linear patterns to create sketch uh, configurations. So we're going. To, the first thing we're going to do is we're going to start a new part. I'm going to start it on the front plane. Do a sketch. Let's just drag a rectangle here, and let's put a couple of dimensions on it. We'll make this and this uh, midpoint, and then we'll make a dimension here of say five and here of ten. Okay. I'm just going to go to features, do an extreme boss base, and let's just say half inch. So that's my first block. I'm going to create another sketch here. Go to normal two. And this time I'm just going to drag and do a couple of, uh, or do a circle actually. Let's just dimension that circle here. Uh, that's going to be a half inch circle. And I want to do a linear sketch pattern on this particular part. And the linear sketch pattern is this entity and we're going to make this thing let's just make it one inch apart I'm just going to put two in there so we see we've got that particular part so we can go in here now and do a feature extrude cut and tell it to cut through all click ok and you see our two holes now from that point we can go in here to our cut extrude and when we click there because of a setting that we had in our um, sketch um, pattern we have the number of instances that now show up so I can right click on there right click on that too tell it to configure that dimension tell it I want this one to be three instances in there three this one to be four and four and this one to be five and five just for the time being click apply click OK to accept and I should have gotten configurations here that list these uh, so I can go from two holes to three holes to four holes to five holes using linear patterns in sketches along with configurations.